welcome back to my channel. So today I am doing a what I eat in a day. I think it's going to be carnivore and keto. Like I think I am going to have a couple things that aren't just like animal product related. So this is, I guess, kind of mostly keto, but I'm also eating a lot of meat, so I don't know. Let's not put labels on anything. This is just like how I like eating. I was carnivore up until Thanksgiving and that went really like, super, super well. And then the day of Thanksgiving, I just ate like everything like everyone else. And then since coming back from Thanksgiving, we started a new menu at my job where I work and it's an Indian menu. And oh my gosh, it is so delicious. But of course I wasn't eating carnivore or keto really and so that like it just made me like spiral out of control and I was like eating just all this random stuff so now I am back eating carnivore and keto because you know it just makes me feel the absolute best I am drinking some coffee this morning and this coffee I wish I had the box I threw away the box the other day because we got a new Keurig drawer thing how cute are these drawers like oh my gosh I love these so much Anyway, the coffee that I'm drinking is this like ketogenic coffee in a pod already. So this, I just got it at Walmart and I got the vanilla flavor. It doesn't have any sweetener, but it already has like the MCT oil and the butter and everything in it. So you literally just like put it in your Keurig and then your coffee looks like this. And I really, really enjoy it actually. I've been drinking this now for a couple of weeks. Once I'm out of those ones and I buy a new box, I'll try and show you guys the box so you know like what it looks like. The box is like dark brown and I got it. It just says like ketogenic coffee, I think. And I just got it at Walmart. And so I'm really enjoying it because it's just so easy to pop it in. You don't have to sit there and like blend the butter or anything like that. So yeah, that's what I'm drinking this morning. I also got a new lunch bag in the mail today. I'm so excited. So let me show it to you. This just came in the mail today from Amazon so I'll link it down below but the reason I got it is because I really wanted a shoulder strap so that way I can like carry because I have a purse too and I have to walk up a bunch of flights of steps like at work and so this is going to be like absolutely amazing and I'm pretty sure it's going to be like pretty heavy duty because this is like metal it's not plastic but I love the gray and brown color it looks like such a cute purse and it has a pocket here so this is like a pretty big pocket. I like to keep like tea packets and you know, something like that. Maybe I can keep my like salt or something. Then it has one on this side. So this one is a little bit smaller. Yeah, so that's that one. And then it has two um, like mesh pockets on the side here. So you could put like a water bottle or something. And then inside, is like so incredibly big like this is actually pretty tall i could fit i could probably fit like oh my gosh this is huge look at that like this is my head and like look this is like two times my head i am legit like so excited for this because all of the lunch bags i've had over the years are always so small and sometimes i'm at work for like two meals or i need to bring like avocado and my homemade dressing and like mayo and like oil and vinegar and like all of the things that i use that obviously i don't want to like use the bad quality stuff at work and so i am so excited because i will finally be able to like fit all of this in here and then i can just throw it over my shoulder and i don't have to like worry about not being able to hold everything i cannot wait so we're gonna be packing this today and using this today what i'm eating today i'm gonna meal prep really quick and it's just some stuff that i got from butcher box because they had this like huge black friday sale so i got some of their fresh salmon which i'm really excited to try like look at that color of that that looks amazing so i think i'm gonna have some salmon like breakfast right now maybe do I want salmon for, I think I might, I want salmon for like lunch. Is that, that's what I mean. It's 1142. I have been not waking up super early, so it's lunchtime. Anyway, but I'm going to, I think I'm going to make the salmon for me to eat for my first meal. And then I got these sweet Italian. I don't know why they're called sweet because it doesn't have any sugar in it, but Italian ground pork sausages from Butcher Box. And I have a couple peppers that need to be used up because they're starting to like rot. 
So I'm gonna like just fry some peppers, maybe some onions, and then uh, cook the Italian sausages. And I think that's what I'm gonna take for work tonight as my meal. And then I'll probably bring some of my RX nut butter that I really, really enjoy. I don't know, maybe some tea, I think. And I don't know what else. I'm not sure, but I am so excited for this. Like, this is such a nice lunch bag. This is the nicest lunch bag I've ever had in my life. So anyway, and I think it was only like $17 on Amazon. That's where I get it, because you know, I always shop at Amazon. I also, the, like the Keurig drawer thing I got on Amazon too. Oh, and I got one more thing. I promise I'm not like just selling stuff right now, but I got just so much stuff over the last couple weeks and I haven't talked to you guys in a while. So I need to make like a favorites video, I think for like December. Um, so I can show off all of this stuff in one video, but I also got this uh, loose leaf tea again from Amazon, but this is a loose leaf teapot. So you put the loose leaf tea in here and it has like some slits at the bottom. And then you just you can boil your water in your little teapot because I got some loose leaf tea from David's Tea on Black Friday to try. So they had a uh, buy to get one free. And so I got pistachio ice cream, cardamom French toast. And then I got this um, Tis the Season. It's an eight pack sampler of all their like holiday teas. So it has Candy King Crush, Palma Grateful, s'mores chai forever frosty gingerbread blondie hot chocolate but it's still like a tea um sleigh ride and alpine punch and like look how cute it is it smells absolutely delicious but like anyway but like look how cute like it comes in these little thingies yeah oh my gosh this smells so amazing so I am really getting into loose leaf tea now, especially since I have this teapot because you literally just like, you know, put some scoops in there and you can boil it and this makes like two cups and I am really, really loving it because I love hot tea so much and I've just gotten so tired of like the tea bags that are in the store because I've, <laughs> I've just like worn them out so much. So love this tea. I cannot wait. I'm going to have to just order from David's Tea quite often and just show you guys like I'm not an affiliate or anything like that. I just found the website, ordered it, really loved it. And so I'm going to keep ordering from them because I like them so much. So I guess we'll make my salmon in a little bit. I'm not quite hungry yet. So I'm going to just drink this coffee and I'm going to read and then I will eat my salmon. Maybe I should just air fry it. Good. Yummy. I'm putting the sausages from Butcher Box in here so that way they can cook while I'm eating my salmon. So the salmon I cooked on 400 for like 15 minutes. And oh my gosh, the salmon is so delicious. I'm gonna have to order this from Butcher Box again because it legit tastes so fresh. Look at that. Oh my gosh, it is so delicious. I am on break. It's like eight o'clock. I think, yeah, 808. And I heated up some of these sausage and peppers. And then I also added some cauliflower from work, this tikka sauce, because we have an Indian menu right now. So it's like a tomato based sauce with like cream and butter. And then some cottage cheese. And I like put some cherry pepper aioli on top. So like mayonnaise and like some peppers to make it spicy. It is going to be so good. I'm so excited to eat this. Like, oh my gosh. It looks absolutely delicious. I'm so hungry right now. Okay, so back from work and it is nighttime. So obviously I need to go to bed, but I wanted to update you guys on what I ate at work. 
so i was so incredibly hungry i ate that whole entire bowl which ended up being three whole peppers like the three whole bell peppers i showed you guys earlier i had cut those up and i had cooked them in the turbo which is like this microwave oven thing that we have and i ended up eating all of those peppers it was like a scoop of cauliflower two of the sausage link things and then it had like the tikka sauce on it two scoops of cottage cheese and then like the sauces i was so hungry and like it was so delicious like oh my gosh that was such a good meal i wonder if i can like make that tikka sauce at home just as a keto type of sauce i feel like that would be so good I'm, I'm definitely gonna have to look up the recipe for that because it's delicious so the only other thing that i had at work that i didn't get to show you guys is like i always have hot tea with half and half at work and so i had a cup of uh, english breakfast tea or like yeah i think it's english breakfast tea um with half and half and then i also had some 90 percent dark chocolate that i had brought in my lunch bag and so uh that's the only other stuff that i ate so uh this is the end of this what i eat in a day and i will definitely see you guys very soon with another video bye everyone <music>